This is Matthew Hatchett, a.k.a. Hatch, and you are now listening to the One Bar in Lupica Show. All right, welcome back to another episode of One Bar in Lupica Show. In this episode, we're going to be doing another rendition of shit or get off the pot when we take a free agent and decide if the Vikings should take a shit which means keep him around, bring him back, or get off the pot, which is move on. So this episode, Dakota Dozier. Yes, Dakota freaking Dozier. Before we get into that, remember, subscribe to the channel, like the videos here every damn day. Put a hashtag down in the comments, hashtag sauce to win this guy. Bing! When we get to 2,500 subscribers. So make sure to subscribe so we can get there and give that thing away. Um, yes, Dakota Dozier. Shit or get off the pot now. I'm not going to come across as the most cheery fellow when I talk about Dakota Dozier in this episode. I'm sure he is a fantastic human. He looks like he gives very good hugs, but let's be clear, he is not a very good guard. And when I say not very good, I am being nice. Um, Dakota Dozier was one of the worst guards in the NFL. There's no sugarcoating that. Um, when you look at it, he gave up six sacks, nine penalties, started um, for the Vikings all 16 games. I'll give him that. He can stay healthy. Um, he had, like I said, he gave up six sacks. I don't think that's including that times where he actually sacked Kirk Cousins himself. So really, I think he gave up probably about 11 sacks. So looking at Dakota Dozier, um, he was uh, he came in the league in 2014. He's 29 years old. He'll be 30 next year. Um, the, the most concerning part about Dozier is when you look at his PFF rankings, um, whether you like those or not, he's, he's gotten worse every year. Uh, generally, you would see a player get better, maybe top off, and as they get older, they get worse. But no, he's uh, he has actually gotten quite a bit worse every single year. Last year for the Vikings, um, obviously he was didn't play as much as he did this year. Gave up two sacks, two penalties, and 360 snaps. Um, his his overall grade was 51.4, pass blocking 47.4, run blocking 51.4. You look at this year, he just hit the shitter. Overall, 44.6 ranking. His pass blocking was horrendous. I'm not even going to go through all the numbers because it's an absolute bore. But just trust me, and we all know this. We all see him, seen him play. Um, if the Vikings brought him back, there might be, I don't know what would happen. Um, it would not be good. If they brought him back, it would be strictly as a backup to the backup to the backup. Um, we know that they have some work to do at guards. We know they don't have much money. I would rather than bring Tom frickin' Compton back than bring Dakota Dozier back. So obviously, I am saying get off the pot when it comes to Dakota Dozier. Dakota, thank you for the 16 games started last year, but please take your talents elsewhere or possibly even into retirement. Um, that is it. Let me know in the comments below if there's anybody that would like Dakota Dozier to come back or what, uh, what you're thinking. Remember, hashtag sauce and subscribe to the channel.